in elementary school there's a couple issues that i faced the first one um, i remember is about racism people weren't really exposed to muslims uh, muslims in canada at that time so they didn't know who we were and uh, what we were about um, i didn't really get much uh, as opposed to my sister who got a lot because uh, she was visibly uh, like because of her hijab like people could tell that she was muslim um, the other thing that we did notice was that because of the fact that uh, that there's around 30 students uh, per classroom um, to one teacher. Uh, it became extremely hard for the teacher to make sure that everyone was learning according to their learning needs. Um, and they would just try to uh, shovel out um, all this information to us. Um, and we basically had to base, uh, try to find a way to understand everything that they were trying to say. Um, it was extremely hard for us because you put up your hand, there's not enough time for the teacher to actually go over and understand what we're trying to say or trying to understand our questions just because of that fact, because they didn't have the, the time to actually go through this. My sister is currently in um, Hadi Elementary right now. She's in grade two. When she first came to Hadi Elementary, um, she had a lot of problems. Um, she was not able to keep up with the, the learning um, speed just because of the fact that the, the schools um, where she was were, were not teaching her fast enough. Enough. In grade two, she wasn't able to read properly. She wasn't able to write properly. Um, we were extremely worried about her because we didn't know what was happening because the school system has dumbified itself quite a bit and now people don't understand how to read and write in grade two. That's really scary for me. Um, when she came to Javi, it took her three months of uh, a lot of work from her. When she got to that level, we see a big improvement. She's sitting there reading things that we never saw her read before. She has a book open. She reads stuff before she goes to bed. Uh, these are things that before she used to be on her iPad all day playing games and watching YouTube videos and now she's reducing that and going back into reading which is uh, really exciting for us to see. The new thing that they're having in Hadi right now is they're doing an enhanced syllabus uh, so basically they're covering um, more uh, topics than what would have been covered in um, a public school environment. Um, that's something that um, it shows that they're going above and beyond in providing that service and trying to create the elite of our next generation.